So today's topic is such a bizarre and almost very minor detail as this is something I didn't even notice at first but as you listen to this more carefully it does become more and more obvious. Anyone want to guess what I'm talking about? Well let's get into it. Quickly though if you haven't already and do appreciate the content I put out on a daily basis feel free to subscribe to the channel that is all I'm going to ask for today. So this being said on with the video. This brand new Venge Stone clip or trailer or whatever you want to call it the thing that was uploaded onto Lego's YouTube channel it's safe to say that it revealed quite a lot of new information. But one of the most unexpected and most just straight up strange things that it did reveal to us that not many people have actually picked up on myself included actually it took quite a little bit of listening to actually you know kind of get this and also i saw it floating around on twitter too but yeah this is pretty good news i'd say and that is jay's voice now i'm not too sure if you guys are aware of this but basically in season 11 it ended up sounding quite high compared to usual and it ended up sounding kind of kiddish and just overall very very childish and it was definitely turned up a notch. I'm not too sure if that was intentional or not. In fact, actually I do believe that Tommy Andreessen has come out and said that it wasn't intentional. Whatever was going on there, from season 11 up until Seabound, it's been slightly out of pitch in a way and there's been a lot more high. However, in this official clip, Jay's voice, it's deeper, it's back to normal, it's a more serious sounding way, if that's even the right word for it. It's really hard to explain, you guys will have to give it a listen and compare this to, say, Jay in the Ice Chapter or something like that. But yeah, give it a listen, compare it, and you guys will definitely see what I mean by this. And I think that's awesome, it's a really small detail, but it's something that I'm glad they have changed. Again, not too sure if this was intentional or not, but hey, it's a change nonetheless, and it's one that I'm very happy to see, because this sounds more like Jay from seasons 1 to 10, which I think suits, suits Jay a lot better. I wasn't really the biggest fan of Jay in season 11 to season 14. Too much, obviously, it's never re it's never really been a huge deal or anything, but it was still there, and it, was, and it ended up bugging me just a little tiny bit so yeah I'm really glad they've changed this and that's basically all I've got to share with you all today I really do hope this kind of reflects the more mature tone Jay is going to be taking in this season of course following the loss of Nia too hopefully that is definitely present there but yeah that's basically all for today's video with this being said feel free to drop your thoughts down below on all of this in the comments I would love to hear your thoughts feel free to drop a like on today's video if you enjoyed it subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and turn on the notification bell so you can be the first to view my latest uploads every single day and with all of this being said I will see you all in my next video coming out very very soon goodbye